On day 14 of this challenge, we learned that if we want to expand x plus y to the power of n, we need to find all the x to the power of something, y to the power of something, such that the summation of powers is equal to n. And then, if I want to have y to the power of k, it means that out of n parentheses of x plus y multiplying by each other, I want exactly k of them to give me y, and everything else is going to give me x. So I need to multiply it by n choose k. And because I need all of these uh, coefficients times x to the power of something, y to the power of something, I need to take a sigma from 0 to n for k. So now I want to add something to that. What if x is equal to 1 and y is equal to 1? In that case, the left hand side is going to be 2 to the power of n and right hand side is going to be sigma of n choose k, k equal to 0 to n. Note that x to the power of n minus k is 1 and y to the power of k is 1. Now, right hand side is all the terms in the n straw of Pascal's triangle and left hand side is 2 to the power of n, explaining why the summation of uh, row n of Pascal's triangle is equal to 2 to the power of n. It actually follows binomial expansion. This is day 16 of my 30 day challenge in counting and combinatorics. Subscribe for more.